Hello, is there anyone here? Hello, hello? Anybody home? Uh, let's see, can we pop up chat? All chats. Uh, there we go. There's some people. This is my first time live streaming on my cell phone. I'm going to attempt to get this guy to come out. You can see his head poking there. I don't know how the audio is. How do I sound? I can't flip cameras, I don't think, from front to back. But can you guys hear me? Can anybody hear me? Sounds good. Simply better. Taylor, David. Oh, David's here. Nisi. So basically, what I'm doing here is see him poking his little snout. I don't know. Hopefully that looks good. But we're going to dump in some frozen blood worms. There they come. Audio is fine. Vince is here. How you doing, buddy? You can see he smells them. Trying to get him to come out during the day with me sitting right here might be kind of tough. Gonna have to wait for them to sink down. Never mind anything you see in the reflection because it is really dirty in my fish room. You should get a South American puffer fish. I agree. The Cuban cichlids. Yeah, I thought I lost a Cuban cichlid, but all six of them are still here. It was a Corydora that I lost, not a Cupid cichlid. Yeah, Kyle, see the eel? He's poking his head out. Normally he's not bashful, but I also normally don't point a phone in his face and talk to him. Well, I'll talk to you guys. My new Moanda cichlids already spawned the other day. Nice, fish nerd. Nice. I saw those. I like the new thumbnail, too. Your eel eats out of your hand? I could probably get mine. Uh, I'm not sure where my blood worms went, but they haven't fallen down yet. All fish fear cameras? I swear they do. Ooh, he's coming out a little more. Uh, the caves are pleco, not pleco caves, uh, cichlid stones is what they're called. Here he comes. There he is. I can't really see what I'm doing because the chat is covering up my screen. Oh, he got one. I think. Look like it. I'm trying to find where the... Oh, the cubes are right here in front of me. Let's knock them down. This will help. There we go. What did I get at the LFS today? I got 24 fish, 18 plants, a new aquarium. Um, unfortunately, that information is on my Patreon. So all my uh, patrons on Patreon know what I got. There he is. And I'll be doing a water change probably in a couple hours on this and siphoning all this junk out. Maybe if I scoot back a bit, now that all the bloodworms are up front. Hello, Deb. Laura. This tank will eventually move, so everything that's in here will move, too. Come on out. I don't care for the Patriots. Nobody does. So David asked, do you... Uh, defrost the blood worms or just drop them in frozen depends on who you ask I just drop them in frozen myself you better hurry up and get out here little eel you're gonna miss out cupid cichlids are looking nice though the fish nerd drops them in frozen as well there you go some people say you need to clean them first. Uh, I've, I've never had. So the kind of eel, it's called, um, it doesn't really have a common name and I cannot pronounce, not even get close to pronounce the scientific name. 
That was not frozen though, they were. I took them out of my freezer. They were probably sitting here for about a minute while I was trying to figure out how to go live from my cell phone though. He's looking at me with those shifty eyes. Will the eel get a partner? Yes, he will. That's part of the new fish I got. It is not the same type of eel though, but I did get more fish for him to hopefully be buddies with. So right now he looks like all the common tire tracks, spiny tail, um, but when he gets bigger and actually colors up, he should have tiger stripes on him. You can kind of kind of start seeing him on the back there. He's just going from cave to cave. This is his normal behavior. We can get down to him here. I should probably spend a little time making this tank look better. There he is. He's getting some good size on him. I'm missing a lot of people's chats. I apologize. Here he's slowly moving forward here. Here he comes. Now you found him. Zoom zoom. It's funny when he actually, if, if I feed him at night, he'll get a hold of an entire block of frozen blood worms and he goes crazy. Starts like spazzing out trying to break it up. It's pretty funny. Anyways, I thought I would just hop on and try to break up the day. I'm doing a lot of stuff in the fish room today, so I needed a break. Matthew, I cannot pronounce the scientific name. He does not have a common name. Once this uploads, I will put the scientific name uh, in the description. Aquatic Hobbyist, how you doing? This guy, full size. Whoa. Uh, should get over 24 inches, so that'll be a lot of fun. He needs a cute name. Yep, I have not named him yet. He does eat a ton, though. He'll eat an entire cube of bloodworms by himself. Uh, I can't really show off anything else in the fish room at the moment. Lake Tang Eel, Tropical Fish Success, I Wish. Wiggles, I like that name, Spaghetti Monster. That's funny too. It is a Mastus Umbellus, but I don't think it's a uh, Vander Whale, Whale Eye, or however you pronounce that. Common name, Longstein. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Do you think Crypt Flamingo would be a good plant for profit? Absolutely not. Um, you can sell them for quite a bit, however, they take forever. Crips are a really slow grower. So you can make money, you're just not going to make very much. But I think we're only going to go for about another minute and a half here. Because i got to get back to work. i got new fish that are floating that I need to get in their tanks. I just got spam that I have a very bad connection. Shotgun Bob has already called that. What? Can I scroll on chat here? Oh, look at that, I can. Sir Ropes a lot? That's kind of funny. That might be the name of one of the new fish I got today. What's my new goldfish called as far as the name? Um, I haven't had a name yet. No name yet. Aquatic Hobbyist says, need to catch up on your videos, been super busy lately. Yep. I will say, for the people that don't follow me on Facebook, or Instagram, or Twitter, or Patreon, I did get a new nano fish tank today to replace that crappy one I bought last week. I'm, I'd feel guilty giving that tank away for free, um, especially to a family member. So I'm giving it to my nephew, but uh, that tank was just really crappy. So I bought a better one today. It's a lot better. Oops, gonna lose focus. 
Thumbs up. Yep, definitely. Do eels like to dig? Not this one. This is the first eel I've ever had, and he hasn't dug at all. Here's one of the plecos under here. You can see the tail sticking out. Kind of, not really. Now it says I have a bad connection again. So I keep getting warning that I have a bad connection, so I'm going to call it right now. Thanks, everyone. It was awesome. Always glad to share this guy. Now that I know that this works in my room, uh, last time I tried to live stream in my room, it said I didn't have a very good signal. And it's telling me. So I'm going to go. I'm going to let this upload and then see what the quality is like. But uh, thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate everyone being here. And uh, don't forget to stop by on Monday at 5 p.m. Pacific, and we'll do an actual live stream.